New York. As Mayor Lindsay said, she's a stately queen made for the miniskirt age. Yes, the Queen Elizabeth II was well and truly in business. Moving into New York Harbor at the completion of her maiden Atlantic crossing, the impressive new Cunada made a stirring sight. Sleek, modern, and at last proved trouble-free, the QE2 was given the type of welcome that New York reserves for only those very special occasions. And this certainly was one of them. Manhattan skyline was a perfect backcloth for the superliner as she prepared to dock in the new world for the first time. On board were 1,400 passengers, 928 crew, and eight dogs. From the first-class staterooms down to the canine accommodation, they'd discovered what comfort at sea could be like. She's a great ship, a 29 million pound piece of British prestige. For the thousands of New Yorkers who came to greet the QE2, this was a time they'll long remember. On both sides of the Atlantic, they're flocking to book passages on her. America had certainly taken this new Queen Elizabeth to their hearts.